She's only 12 years old, and she's got the entire country talking about her. She is Grace Vanderwall. Hi, Just a year ago, I was in the marching band, and, like, no one knew I sang. And this entire experience has just been amazing, honestly. It's changed my life forever, I think. Like, ah! It feels like I'm a famous person or something. I'm not, don't worry. <laughs> I love this shirt. <laughs> I feel like a princess there. And there, so much challenge is in the semifinal. I was always afraid that I wasn't a good singer. We're all going to remember when we saw Grace sing live for the first time. I never imagined I could win. But every single day, I want it more and more badly. And I don't know why. I feel like I'm a flower just like going like this. I'm more motivated every single day to write more songs. The song I'm doing tonight is just about letting yourself shine, and that's what I'm trying to do for the semifinals. I'm just trying to shine. I feel a lot of pressure. It's just building up, and I'm just trying not to explode. Yeah. But my confidence is growing, and I feel like I can do it. They got nothing on us. I don't think you understand. Let's go out and do something we'd never do. Cause I feel like I can do anything when my head is spinning and my feet off the ground. When I can't stop dancing like no one's around, and yeah. I think we were born to shine Cause the stars are down when they're compared to you and I And if people don't like it, they, they can close their eyes Cause we're not the same And we don't have to try We're brighter than fireflies, we're gonna light the sky A true likeness guy. Wow. Mel B, you gave her a standing ovation. Oh, Grace, Grace, Grace. Now, let me ask you, was that your own song that you wrote? Yes. You know, Grace, I mean, you're 12 years old. You have such a unique voice, and you're so in control of everything. At 12 years old, you're already a superstar, and you, you just, it's like... You are, you are the nicest, most humblest, sweet little girl. I just love you. I love you. You're great. <laughs> Heidi. Grace, you are a superstar. You are the real deal. And I would not be surprised if you were one of the last two people standing here in this competition. That is my prediction. 
Mr. Simon Cow. Look, this is very simple, Grace, because everything's worked because it comes from you. You know, every, I know every idea comes from you, the songs come from you, the lyrics come from you. I think you sing for a new generation. And I am so flattered and thrilled that you decided to come on this show to showcase your talent. And now I hope America, which is really important, don't take this for granted. I hope they really pick up the phone and put you where you deserve to be in two weeks' time, which could be the best final we've ever done on this show. How? You know, really quickly, it started with you telling the world they don't know your name. Now the world knows your name. The world knows your talent. The world knows your grace. And the world knows you could win this. Wow, Grace. To hear all of those amazing things and to know that everyone truly witnessed something special here tonight, how does that make you feel? Thank you. That's just incredible. Everything, this entire experience has been just... Unbelievable, it's so amazing that it's been happening to me. Good luck, America. She needs you. Voting is already open. It's a girl from Suffern, New York, who loves normal 12 year old kid stuff. But when she picks up a ukulele and sings, she becomes a superstar. She is Grace Vanderwall. Good afternoon, Suffern Middle School. We have a student of ours on America's Got Talent. Grace, we just want you to know that everybody's supporting you every step of the way. I've been writing songs for a while, but only now, this year, I've been starting to share them. They're like a tiny peek inside of my head. The earliest one I can remember was about my door. <laughs> that makes any sense. I've always sang, like, as long as I can remember. It just gives me the best feeling. Tonight, I'm singing a song that I wrote about my sister. We're a tight group. Are you nervous? She's my best friend. She's always afraid before she performs, but she, she gets up there and she always says amazing. Wow, that's 116 million views. this happened to me. I still feel like I'm about to wake up from this crazy dream. I hope that there's more to come. You think that you know my heart and you probably do So I'm always with you I could stay with you for hours In an empty room And never get bored Never have nothing to do You're my other half You what makes me me What makes me smile When I'm full down I can't get back, back, back up On my feet You're a beautiful thing We're a beautiful thing together even when the weather is low You're a beautiful thing We're a beautiful thing together Even when the weather is low We can find a rainbow Up in the sky you say Don't you cry, it's all gonna be
Wow. Definitely a beautiful thing. Come on down here, Grace. Such a beautiful thing. Awesome job. Simon Cow on his feet along with everyone else in this building. Talk to her. Grace, you know, look, I'm going to be honest with you, OK? How old are you? Go, 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 go How ahead. How old are you? Uh, 12. Uh, 12. 12, sorry. 12 sorry. years old. You wrote the song, I presume, yeah? Yes. OK. So, you know, some of the stuff you were playing, maybe the notes are wrong, your voice is a, voice is a little bit croaky at times, and, but that is what makes you perfect. Because I always believe these shows are about finding potential. And it's somebody who, in the real world, can have a career. And there's something so sweet, so charming about you, and like I said, so real. Everyone was waiting for this performance. I am going to predict we're all going to remember the moment in years to come when we saw Grace sing live for the first time. Thank you so much. That makes it so simple. Heidi. Gosh, I mean, Grace, you are so very talented. I can only say, save the best for last, and you are one in a million. Thank you so much. Mel B. I mean, you are just as cute as a button. I just want to cuddle you. You know what it is about you? You've just got one of those voices that you remember. Yeah. It's very distinctive. Right. But you know what I want to give you? I want to give you a big boost of confidence because you need to know exactly how good you are. You're amazing. Howie, this is your golden buzzer pick. Talk and to you know us. what? You are my golden buzzer, and you are my golden buzzer in life, because I got to tell you something, that you are, Simon said the first time, you're the next Taylor Swift. I predict that you're bigger than Taylor Swift. I predict that you are the biggest star to ever come out of this show. People are going to be saying Grace Vanderwall for time to time. 400 million people online are watching you. All the biggest people in the business ask me about you each and every yeah. day. You are a superstar. America's got to vote. You're the best thing I've ever seen on this show. I love you. I love you. Again, you are the talk of America. Everyone always was just waiting to see this moment. Now the most important question, can you teach me how to play the ukulele? <laughs> All right, awesome. Good luck tonight, Grace. You are I'm Grace Vanderwall. I'm 12 years old, and I love to sing. I live in New York with my mom, my dad, my sister, and my two dogs, which I love dearly. What are you looking at? The cannon. The cannon. <laughs> my older sister, Olivia, is 15, and she's my best friend. She's just very supportive, and I love it. Big hugs? I want to be a part of the big hug. How are you? When Grace was about three, she actually started writing music just in her mind. She would make up a song with a wireless <laughs> microphone. I said, what's wrong with you? I really love you. I'm trying to set my expectations very low. I've never sang in a crowd this big before, and this is just going to be so different to be like in front of all these people. What do you think? Let me fix your bow. Your bow's a little... I saw Nick Cannon walk by, and I was just like, oh my gosh! And like, that was just one person. I don't even know how I'm going to do it. Two days ago, she whispered in my ear, Mom, I'm getting a little nervous. <laughs> She's only 12, and I'm scared because I want everything that she does to be successful. And I just... <laughs> All I can do is keep... I just hope she can do it. You ready to go get him? Yes. All right, have fun out there. I'm doing my own song tonight because I really think that shows who I am. I hope. I hope it does. I really hope. <laughs> What is your name? Grace. Grace, you're a beautiful young lady, you know that? Thank you. <laughs> How old are you? Uh, 12. Are you excited to be here? It's crazy. <laughs> what are you going to sing? I'm singing in original. Really? Yes. What's it about? It's about me. <laughs> And other people at school behind you, supporting you? Most of my friends don't really know I sing. So they don't know you're here? No. You believe that you can win? Well, I mean, miracles can happen, so possibly. The stage is yours. Good luck.
about surprises and you use the word miracle and I think you are a living beautiful walking miracle your original the people not knowing your name is so right and so wrong because I think the world is going to know your name I think right now they're going to know your name because you are going right now. predict for you, I think you are the next Taylor Swift. I 100% think we've got a star. Amazing. Wow. Yeah, I wow. really do. That is a big this, this wow. girl is special. She is yeah. special. Wow. And I'm now annoyed I didn't press the golden button. <laughs> <laughs>